Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. It is almost time for gloves. That's how cold it is. I don't know where my coat went. And we lost Sophie's barn coat. Gabby took it to the school. Aha! Uh -huh. It is early <laughs> and it is cold. Chino Bambino decided to sleep in this stall last night. So we put down a ton of bedding. Sam even went to the store last night to get bedding for him. I'm telling you now, if Chino comes around after all this, it's because of the hard work and dedication, man. Like, there's a lot of crying. A hard work, dedication, and a lot of crying. He seems better today, though, in terms of his spirit. He was probably mad at us. We woke him up. Good job, Sophie. I do not want Sophie to grow up like me and be too old completely tool illiterate. She is learning to work tools. And Sam is helping. So Penny is definitely in heat. And she just caused a stampede in the whole barnyard. <laughs> We've been feeding them hay. We've been leaving hay in the barn because we don't know how much grass is really out there anymore. So they come in every day. They come in several times a day and eat hay. <laughs> Plus there's frost. Once the frost comes, it changes the quality of the hay, the grass, so. <laughs> Yay! She needs a brush. Hi. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hi. How are you? Hey? Good girl! What a good pony. So, like I showed you before, Sophie hung this up. <laughs> this thing's not coming off, that's for sure. How many screws did you put in here? All of them. <laughs> Did Dad tell you to do that? Yes. Well, look at his. He used all of them too. Where's his? Oh, so there's one there. And one over here. If you didn't see yesterday's vlog, Sam got these off of Timu. They're like $34 or $40 something. dollars, And they're like hard. Storm loves them. And honey. And honey. I just gave Penny a brush. When Penny gets into heat, sometimes I have to wash her back end a lot every single day, every day. Well, hello, Gracie girl. Okay. How's it going? Yeah, Penny is uh, on fire. Okay, today we are headed out. Sophie's gonna have lessons. Because we didn't put in a outdoor, we're driving in now for lessons. The area that we have to ride right now is on a hill. So it makes it not as good for storm. And he started pulling shoes because he was going so slow. So we don't want that to happen. So we're gonna. We should like duct tape his shoes on the way Chino has his shoes duct taped on. I'm not gonna lie, you guys. This horse has been the best gift. And this horse. Has been too. Yeah, I know. She just comes anywhere we take her. Does whatever we want with her. Like. Yeah, eat that grass. It needs to get picked up. I need grass over here picked up too. He's like, okay. <laughs> eat some grass. You guys get treats for coming with us everywhere we take you. Quickly grab Storm a carrot. It's okay. <laughs> he gets a carrot for being such a good boy. It was so good today. Penny's like, oh, you handsome man. He was forward. He was fabulous. They all love Storm, even though Storm is in trouble. I know. Hey, oh, good lord. All right, let's get you some more water. We have a blanket on Chino today. You should take it off now. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, yesterday Chino had a, a bad spell. He started to go downhill and called the vet and the vet came. A different vet, not the vet we've been dealing with that knows the situation. I tried explaining it to him. I tried showing him a video. We put new shoes on him yesterday with the hopes that it would take like pressure off his feet and he would feel better. But it's not working and he's on a lot of pain medication and the pain medication used to work for him. It just stopped working. So we had the vet again today and he doesn't think it's Anyway, I just wanted you guys to know that we're pretty sure that Chino's at the end and our vet thinks that there's more going on than just Lyme disease and he thinks that 
the feet issue is a byproduct of what's going on. It's not like anyway. I just want to. I just want to keep you guys. It's hard for us to say okay, yes. Yeah. It's just a really hard and confusing time because even though Chino has late stage Lyme disease, it's the complications and it's the stuff that 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 happening to his body his body is just failing his whole body is just failing and he fought and suddenly he's just not doing as well so anyways I just feel numb like I don't even know what to say like I have no words we need to wait for Gabby your horse escaped. How and how? I was opening the gate and she ran out. Is she back in there? <laughs> no. Do you think I can catch her? Willow? Yep. <laughs> so easy. Oh, you guys. Gabby's almost home. And it's time. I'm not hiding anything. Think you know me too well. Try and get Chino out to the grass so he can eat grass. Our vet thinks that he was right all along and that Chino definitely does have something more than Lyme disease. He thinks he has cancer. He just like took this turn yesterday. Just keep trying and I knew in my heart that he was done, but he's saying that he doesn't think we should try anymore because he's had a really, really rough day. I don't know if any of this is making sense. I've been feeding him chaff all day. He's watching me. But we really want him to go out there and be on the grass. Who stole the carrot? But it was Ruby. I keep saying like, I keep like second guessing myself like <sighs> up until yesterday his pain pills have been wonderful for him and helping him so much and then yesterday everything just shut down and they just stopped working. His whole body is failing. At least we tried. But he's worse. The shoes helped this much. Try to get him out to grass. He really wants to go out there. Don't know if I can get through, get through to you. Your eyes keep wandering. If you made up your mind to leave this behind, then I can't force you to stay. If my eyes can't convince you that I'm still in love since you first took my hand on that sweet summer night, and if you're Like, he's like, this was worth it. If my eyes can't convince you that I'm still in love since you first took my hand on that sweet summer night, and if your heart. 